Hey folks, it's IOE, so we're back with some more World of Tanks. As you can see, this is Vert. This is Vert, <laughs> and he's in his FV four thousand five. This is a tier ten game on the new Polish map, and we're gonna call it Stud <laughs> because I am horrible with names. And I don't feel like butchering anymore right now. Anyway, so um, I keep forgetting the uh, the 4005 can only turn its turret 180 degrees. It is until it gets pointed out to me that I remember all over again. Um, so this is a uh, of course a he is watching himself. He's staring at the side of his tank. Let's zoom in on. Bring the heat and anti arty Oh, well, he is, well. He doesn't have any heat in the tank, so there's that. He can't bring the heat because he has no heat. And this thing is basically artillery. It, it's pointing quick artillery, direct fire artillery. That's what I was trying to get at. So. <laughs> Communication. He's asked his ally to please destroy a wall. However, his ally seems to be ignoring him because, unfortunately, Infert has forgotten that this is World of Tanks and not a game where you communicate with your team effectively, right? Effectively communicate with your team, not whatever. You know what I mean. Okay, so the T100 LT is trying to get spots up. However, what he may, not, or may not realize is guys on the other side of this bush are proxy spotting him. So it doesn't matter if he's not lit. As soon as he goes up on that hill, he is lit because <laughs> they're close enough to the bush to be able to see it. The K91 seems to have destroyed the wall, probably because he was shooting at something else. And now, oh look at that! <gasps> Oh, the shell dipped! If that shell had not dipped and had hit the AMX flush in the side, that would have been some death right there. <laughs> that would have been like, oh, that would have been beautiful. But no, that's not, that's not what happened. So, goes up with the shell and tries it again. This time, he's hoping to hit the IS-7. But the IS-7 has got to show him something to shoot at. That will take 750 damage to an IS-7 is worth it. That IS-7 is going to be feeling it in the morning and probably wants to leave the game right now. As he just got shot in the face by artillery, more or less. Ooh, apparently the IS-7 is still up for a fight though. And there's an SCRV back there. There was an SCRV back there. And SCRV is currently burning to death because he didn't bring a fire extinguisher. He actually burned to death. Now, I don't think we did all of his health and damage. I'm fairly certain somebody hit him um, for a little bit of damage while we were burning him to death. But um, he, he completely <laughs> burned to death. <laughs> so there's that. Um, that poor SCRV. Just because of the fact that he fired from exactly the same direction as the I-7 meant we knew where he was. Wasn't like there was any place for him to hide. <laughs> and so, just fire a shell along the same trajectory. And what do you know? You hit. Um, this I-7 though is giving us some troubles. Looks like he's reverse side scraping and he's about to pull back out again. Come on, don't keep me waiting. Pull back out. Show us that. Okay, the I-7 is walking away. That's a bit annoying, but oh well. It does mean we're a little bit more free to push up on this hill. Oh! Mm, so close to taking out the white tank. 
in a single hit. Um, our light tank has retreated to the other side of the map, so we don't actually have any support as far as uh, just some popping over the ridge and taking him out kind of thing. Um, we're either going to have to do that ourselves, or we're going to have to wait until he does something really dumb and the, K the K91 takes him out. Or, alternatively, we could hope he sticks his head up again, and maybe the badger could hit him, but in all likelihood, most likely we're going to have to take him out. Sorry for all the yawning, guys. Um, I just got done with work, and um, this is, of course, the only time I have to record. And if I record any later, then you guys won't be getting a video tomorrow. Or, you know, when you're watching this, <laughs> you won't be getting a video today. So, yeah. Sorry. It's, uh, it's just the way it's got to go down. Enemy K91 looks like it wants to get involved in the fight um, but I don't think it is actually going to come up to the point where we can actually shoot at it um, IS-7 is starting to focus on pushing around there's still an, an IS-4 in front of us though we no longer have that light tank because the badger took care of it so if the badger took care of the light tank now we can start to focus on um and everything else that needs to die. So there's really only an IS-4 in front of us at this point in time. There isn't likely to be anything else on this line. And so with Badger being the only thing directly in front of us. And the only thing we can shoot at. Uh, he's, I'm sure he's tempted to shoot it. However, note that... Oh, uh, the IS-4 is basically... Pres Never mind. I was gonna say something about you know needing to take a couple shots to kill him. He was gonna like guard this side of the map for his team. He was yeah, no that none of that happened. Just oh. dead. <laughs> okay. Well, um, that that poor poor guy. <laughs> we're, we're gonna speed this up a little bit, assuming he doesn't get into damn man combat anytime soon. He just goes ahead and blows up the poor 430U. However, now he's at a point where he cannot get hit again. If he gets hit again, he's going to die. And so... Ooh, I slowed this back down again. How did... Oh, I must have hit the speed up button instead of the slow down button. Um, yeah. Fat fingers. That's what that is. Um... K91 in the background. Oh, come on, I7. Just, just, just walk on out here. Nothing bad is waiting to send you to the grave at all. Totally. I, I swear on my... I don't know. W won't you just believe me? No? Okay. Well, that's probably for the best for you. I-7 is looking for us. That poor I-7 has no idea where we are. And so it just decides that... Uh, if it, it doesn't know where we are, it's not going to push. Looks like the two of them are staying close together. Which is really great news. A, it means it's going to let us maneuver a bit more. But B, I, I like the fact that they're sticking together. Their last four tanks on their team, if they're not united, well, you know, what's the point? Um, the monster, it keeps walking past this window, so if you can time it right, maybe we can do something. Uh, the Badger is pushing. Uh, if the Badger gets a shot into the IS-7, then this game could all be over. Or the IS-7 could charge, and the Badger would just basically back up. And prevent... Pres blah, 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 blah. If I could talk, this would be so much easier. Present. A smaller target. Unfortunately... Ooh, that shot missed. Um, yeah, that's not how that quite worked out. Um, and he just does get spotted, but it's only right here. Right here, the, uh, what's it called? The, the K9-1s would have been safe, but, uh, it's not quite the way it works. As the enemy K9-1 is spotted, but way down the other end of the map, we're going to speed this up. Uh, a few times so that we actually get there before I'm old and gray. 
Um. Oh, he's really got to move. <laughs> oh. I did not expect the K91 there. Um. But yeah, that's such cool. Oh yeah, come on. T. Did I almost call it TBB? Because I think I did. It's a <laughs> FV 4005. Nope, it's a game over because E5 got him. Well done, sir. Thank you so much for saying this in. You've got to show me how to pronounce this name. All I can read it here is it's Vert Ra Guest Er. Something like that. So. Ho hopefully, I, I didn't butcher that too much. You can tell me where you're from and what kind of name this is, and if it means anything. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the post game and uh, the other bits. I'll see you later. Ace Tanker, nice job. Uh, Bruiser Arsonist, Fighter, Fire for Effect, 21 Bonds, 100,000 Credits, High Caliber, and Tank Sniper Awards. Well done. I know he only shot everything once, with the exception of, with the exception of a couple of things. Um, I don't remember where that sentence was going. Six thousand damage. You, sir, are a member of the Six K Damage Club. Good job. Uh, if you're not already in the Discord, then uh, the link is in the description. Come join the Discord. And then tell me about this game, and I will get you your 6k damage roll. Thank you so much. Well done. This is a good game. I liked it a lot. And uh, I'll see you all next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great night. This is IOE throughout.